Rin Standing Stones an overhaul of the magical stone locations to make them more interesting and lively, decorative, thought out, fitting to the environment that they are found in. Some locations have been turned into ruins or strongholds now abandoned. Others, epic exterior mini dungeons with an enemy or five to take care of, making those hard to reach places a little more rewarding for the effort. You almost get a sense of history instead of rushed development. The author's intent is to provide you with more excitement and enjoyment while exploring, and these stone sites do just that. But not all locations have enemies or debris. Some are simply more fleshed out as the beautiful attractions they should be. Destinations worthy of the pilgrimage. Hold Border Banners places a marker in the form of each hold's flag where one hold ends and the next begins. A bit of ancient GPS to help you find your way. A loving monument to Taylor, a deceased member of the modding community, placed at the location of his last save file. A fallen warrior to never be forgotten. Near Raven Rock lies a small fishing camp with a new tent mesh and texture. Hockey and his wife work and live here while selling seafood and ingredients. A simple and fitting mod adding a bit more life to a desolate coast. Ramiro Statues HD, a texture replacer for all the statues that are shown today. Nothing over the top, highly detailed, Bethesda aesthetic. The original design has simply been enhanced upon for an updated look and feel. Civil War Checkpoints Choose one, two, or all three locations to help immerse you deeper in Skyrim's Civil War. Guards have schedules. Containers are owned. Checkpoints change hands based on the war's outcome. My name's Michael. Welcome to Gamer Poets and to Modding My Way. Step-by-step -step instructions on how I create my personal load order are on my website. Thanks for joining me.